Hey guys, Matt here. Um, this is going to be a quick little video. A lot of people have been sending me PMs and comments and emails asking me about this whole thing that's going around about, uh, you know, states uh, signing petitions to secede from the union and that kind of thing. And what did I think about it? Um, there's a lot of mixed uh, feelings on this issue as far as um, will it do any good? Is it worth it? Um, you know, uh, is this the right way to do it? I mean, how many signatures, you know, can, you know all that kind of stuff. Um, so I wanted to go over that kind of stuff. Uh, first off, I will start by saying I did go over and I did sign the, the petition not only for Texas, which is my state, but also for every other state that I saw there, every other petition. In fact, while I was there, I even signed a few petitions that had nothing to do with any of this stuff, just because it was stuff that I, I looked at and said, yeah, that makes sense. I'll sign the petition. Um, so I recommend you guys go check it out. I'll put a link in the description box down below. It's, it's petitions.whitehouse.gov. Um, now on to the question of do I think this is going to do any good or this is going to go anywhere? The answer is no. This is not going to result in any state seceding from the union. Okay. What you got to understand is this is not official in any capacity. Okay. You are not officially petitioning the federal government. What you are doing is going to a website that was created by the Obama administration to kind of placate the masses. Basically, it's an it's a it's a website they started so that people would feel like they were being heard. All right? It's not official with the federal government in any way. It is simply an administration thing. Um, you're going there and they're telling you, hey, get this many signatures and we will publicly address your issue in one way or another. It doesn't even mean they actually have to come out and personally say anything. It could be something as simple as they send an email to everyone that signed the petition um, that was written by some intern in the White House you know, saying yes or no. Um, don't think that Obama's going to come out and say anything, or even the press secretary is going to come out and say anything. Um, but in the end, the reason I signed it is because it is still yet another way that we can help send a message. Will it do any good in the long run? Probably not. But I firmly believe that we should keep sending as many messages as we can to this current administration that we think they are screwing the pooch, that this is bullshit, we don't like what they're doing, and you know that we want to change we want a real change for the better um, so for that reason and that reason alone I think it's worth the time it takes it literally takes two seconds to go sign the petition you click the button that's it you, you open up an account there with your name and your email address and you click sign petition and then you go to another one and you click sign petition that's it you don't have to type your name in a hundred times for every petition each one literally takes two seconds to sign um, so I highly recommend you go and do it because you know, if you get 100,000 people signing these petitions for, for that, that is, that is, they are going to have to address this in some way. It's already starting to creep into the internet media. I want to see it creep onto CNN and MSNBC and Fox and all that. Um, because this is just another way to send a message. So let's make it as public as we can. Let's get as many signatures as we can. But, but just don't be fooled. Don't be delusioned. In the end, it's not going to lead to your state actually seceding from the union. So anyway, that's it, guys. Um, I appreciate you guys watching. Definitely go click the link and check it out and sign a petition or two. And uh, we'll talk to you later, guys. Thanks.